Kiss 105.3 and 1340. We're hip hop and RB. Live the day party with your favorite DJ, DJ D. Sewell. Y'all, let's discuss some hip hop news now. It is time for. D. Sewell, what the hell happened today? And a lot of stuff happened today. We got to start off and talk about all the projects that dropped today, and a lot did, y'all. Jeezy, he dropped his double album. I had planned on checking it out before I did this today. Y'all, I got on there, that thing said an hour and 30 minutes long. That's a lot of music from Jeezy. I have to catch Jeezy this weekend, y'all. That was too much for today. But uh, Jeezy dropped a big project. T Grizzly dropped. Famous Dex dropped. The Alchemist dropped a project. Uh, Kevin Abstract, he dropped a new project. Marshmallow dropped. Magic Jordan dropped. I like them a lot. They're signed to Drake's OVO label. They do R&B. Y'all should check them out. Sunny Digital dropped. And Big Fizzle representing Arkansas dropped a new project as well. Y'all, in other news and a crazy story, Suge Knight, during a recent interview, said that Deion Sanders in the 90s was secretly signed to Death Row Records. He said Deion Sanders came to him and said he wanted to rap. He said he put $500,000 into Deion Sanders' rap career when they got ready to drop Deion Sanders had a deal with Nike. And he said Nike was not trying to work with him or Death Row Records. So they had to put out Deion's music under Interscope Records. He said, but the whole time, Dion was secretly signed to him. He said he didn't make any money from Dion. <laughs> he didn't put that part in there, but he said Dion was signed to him, y'all. That was just saying. Y'all believe that or not, y'all. In other news, Missy Elliott, she was inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Uh, Willie Nelson, Sheryl Crow, Rage Against the Machine, and more were inducted last night. And uh, Missy is the first female rapper ever. Now, that is big. Missy was very excited about it. If you're a regular to this and seen me talk about the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame before, you know how I feel. If you have not heard me talk about this before, well, I'm going to tell you straight up, I do not rock with the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame at all. I have no idea what it has to do with hip-hop. Hip-hop needs their own thing, and I don't like trying to get accepted by the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. I don't give a damn what they feel about hip-hop or who they, who they think did what in hip-hop. I could care less, to be completely honest with y'all. But you know what I'm saying? I get it. That's the only Hall of Fame that we got right now. So congratulations to Missy. But yeah, boy, could care less about the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Y'all in other news and in another crazy story. Y'all, T Grizzly knocked himself out during Constantinette's jail live stream. Y'all, they been messing around. You know it's not a for real live stream. But it was supposedly a cafeteria fight. T Grizzly was trying to get on down and avoid the situation. He slipped and fell into a wall, knocked himself out. He was not moving for seconds. Like everybody jumped serious, y'all. They were just messing around and things got real. But he started moving, he is okay. And uh, Casanet Jail live stream is over. Yesterday was the last day, y'all. They wild and they doing the most. And last but not least, we gotta talk about Burner Boy. He had a big offer to do a gig in Dubai for $5 million. Burner Boy turned that thing down straight up, y'all. In Dubai, you cannot smoke, and Burner Boy was not going for none of that, y'all. He's standing on his business. That's what he's doing straight up. But he turned that down, y'all. He is getting to that bag, but five million is a lot of money. One time for Burner Boy. Yeah, that's what the hell happened today. Y'all have a great weekend. I'll be back next week. We're here with the kids on the 5.3, 13 points.